All right, so here's the 2022 Audi Q5 Sportback. So this is a premium plus that's finished in glacier white with the black interior with the gray stitching. And this happens to have the 20 inch uh, optional alloy rims. Now for 2022, all Q5s are S lines now. So now they've actually changed some of the grill orientation here. Now the small, small detail here between this and a regular Q5 is still this nice little metal element that gives a little more of a 3D mesh look to it. So that's one thing that still makes this unique compared to the rest of the vehicles and also the SQ5s in the lineup. So you have full UV lighting on this car with a top camera, adaptive cruise control, lane keep assist. This also has the navigation package and also the Bang & Olsen audio system. So power is uh, uh, powered by a four cylinder turbo, two liters. It's actually pumping out 261 horsepower and 273 pounds of torque. It's connected to a seven speed dual clutch transmission. And zero to 60 happens around 5.6, 5.7 seconds. And you have ultra, the Quattro Ultra system here. So if, now if you don't need all four wheels at work, it does decouple the rear axle. So it's a very, very cool looking automobile, very nice streamlined design. I think one of the best ones in the segment in terms of the uh, coupe-like design in this segment. Some very nice strong uh, fender flares, really sharp looking automobile. Now let's check it out the interior. All everything is no nonsense, straight to the point, and just high build quality overall. So in this particular model, it's gonna have the matte finish wood with the gray stitching. You can see the Bang & Olsen audio system here on the back. And all of the beam rings that come into play. You got an adjustable virtual display for your virtual cockpit. All your controls are at your fingertips. You got your climate controls and so forth in the center and your 10.1 inch MMI touch response entertainment system. Sport seats are standard on the sport pack, so you get the heavily bolstered seats that hold you in place. And if you get the warm weather package, you also get ventilation on this model. So standard is heated seats and then four-way adjustable headrests. And then checking out the rear space, even though it has a raked roof line, you still have them a very, very common interior space for adults at any size. Three zone climate control with USB-C ports. And once again, tons of room and you got the nice panoramic roof. Once again, nice materials found throughout the interior. So a very nice setup overall. So one cool thing is after, from about the D pillar back is where everything changes compared to a traditional Q5. You got really a nice uh, sequential lighting here in the rear. Sorry about the space in the back, but let's go ahead and show you. It is all power operated. And you have tons of cargo capacity when needed. It's all simple to use, very quiet on operation. We got quick uh, releases here for the rear seats and tons of space to work with in terms of cargo capacity. If you need be, fold down the seats and you have additional space. So still a very, very useful and cool looking SUV overall. Here's your controls once again for the door, for the tailgate, and also does have the quick uh, kick feedback. If you have the key in your pocket, and it'll open and close for you. Power folding mirrors, integrated turn signals, and click right here, one more look inside. Very sharp and clean overall interior. So once again, the Q5 Sportback. Been a home run so far, and uh, they're a lot of fun to drive, and there's no compromises really what to speak of. So thanks for tuning into the video, and we'll have a lot more videos to come soon. Hope everybody's doing well. Please share, subscribe, and like, and we'll catch you later.